With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry, and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question, and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello. So our question is the decreasing order of electrical conductivity of the following aqueous solution. It has been given 0.21 m of formic acid. It is a formic acid, not forming acid. And the second is given having the same concentration as 0.1 m acetic acid, then it will be 0.1 m benzoic acid. So first of all, what we have to know, what is the electrical conductivity? It is the tendency to conduct the electricity. It is the tendency of the substance in order to conduct electricity through itself. And here, the electrical conductivity depends upon two things, the number of ions present and the concentration of ions. If the number of ions and concentration of ions are increasing, then the conductivity, electrical conductivity also increases. So here, in all the cases, the concentration is constant. That is, all the conductivity of the compound will depend upon the number of ions. And here, all the things are given in acid. So here, what happens? If the acid will have the higher acidic strength, then it can easily lose the proton that is H plus ion and the number of ions will increase. The number of ions thus increases and thus we can say that the electrical conductivity will also increase. So electrical conductivity can easily be predicted if it is good acid. That is it can easily donate its H plus. So if you try to know the structure of uh, benzoic acid, then the structure of benzoic acid is like this. It is C double bond O, O, H. If suppose we lose the proton from the benzoic acid, then what happens? There will be a generation of negative charge on the oxygen. And if any electron withdrawing group is present with the negative charge, then it can easily stabilize it. Here the benzene is a electron withdrawing group and it can easily stabilize this negative charge and thus it can act as a good acid. So firstly we have to just arrange all the things. So here if we try to know about the acetic acid and compare it with the benzoic acid, so it is having CS3, C double bond O, OH. If we lose the proton from here, then it becomes CS3, C double bond O, O minus. In this case, CS3 group is electron donating group. It will donate its electron and it will make this negative charge destabilize. So from here we can say that it is not so good acid in comparison to benzoic acid. So from here what we can say that we can easily say that the benzoic acid because of having the electron withdrawing group of benzene it can easily stabilize the negative charge and act as a good acid from the acetic acid. Now if we talk about the formic acid, so this is a type of a unique case. Here what happens? It's a structure like this. And what happens here? If we try to lose the proton from here, then in this case, it will make this type of an ion. And here what happens? Here the resonance type of occurrence takes place. What happens here? We will get what? We will get a delocalization of electrons or negative charge here and it becomes the resonating structure. But important point to be remembered is that here in benzoic acid also resonating structure is possible. But in this case, there is two identical resonating structures are present. Due to this case, it is important to be remembered that the formic acid will be the most acidic among the benzoic acid and the acetic acid. This is a type of exception you can say that because of the identical resonating structure. So from here what we can say that the acidic strength of the formic acid is more than that of benzene and then it will be acetic acid at the last. So from here what we can conclude that the Formic acid will give more number of ions. So its electrical conductivity that is formic acid 
will have the highest electrical conductivity then it will have the benzoic acid then at last it will be acetic acetic acid so from a what we can say that our fourth option is correct i hope you got this concept thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today